Oh, welcome back. This is Leviathan, and we are back with uh, Wind Waker. And uh, yes, I finally managed to beat that boss and not get the stupid heart piece. That was annoying. It took two more tries after I had stopped the video to get it right. Two. Yeah, that's right, Link. You make you make that face, cause. And now we gotta talk to this uh, post box. Good evening. Letters for Link. We have one letter. Here is your letter. Dear Link, if you are reading this, it can only mean that you have peeked into one of our many post boxes. I am in debt to you. I am. I'm very sorry I let you leave without thanking you. Please accept my heartfelt apology along with my thanks. We can we cannot do much to help you, but we can at least do this. If you s get any letters or parcels for you, we'll deliver them to a post box near you. If you see any wiggling post boxes, please look inside them. I suppose you have a long way to go before your per perilous journey is done. I have included a gift for you with my letter in the hope that it might help you. Please accept this small token. I look forward to the day that we meet again. Uh. Oh, you asshole! Do you guys, do none of you understand the point of a three heart challenge? Stop giving me these things. Alright. Yep. Dude. Shut your face hole. Now we gotta travel. Basically that way. Yeah, that way. Mm. Right. So yeah, it's not going to be that long of a travel. It's probably the same length as uh, from uh, Dragon Roost to here. It's around there. Maybe one more square. But, um... Yeah, it's not a big deal. But, uh... <laughs> oh my gosh. That was so annoying, though, that boss. I mean, you guys saw it. It just absolutely annoyed the shit out of me. And whew, someday, hopefully, I will never come across any more heart pieces. Oh my gosh, because those are dangerous enough as it is, <clears throat> let alone almost being forcibly pushed into grabbing a heart container. I wish I had the HD version, because if I had the HD version, I could get that uh, Swift Sale. I think that's what it's called. And then I could be going like twice or three times faster. I don't know how fast it works, but it would be very helpful. Ah, she's net. Uh, I've got to do some dodging and weaving here. And it's getting dark. Don't come at me, don't come at me, don't come at me. Stay away from me. 
Stay away. Screw you! I think they're like a puffer fish, but have like helicopter blades. <clears throat> Very odd. <clears throat> Almost there. So that island way over there. I see it. I see it way over there. Pretty sure that's the island. Yeah, that's the island. can jump. Legend of Zelda 2 and Wind Waker, but he only, well, technically he's both doing the jumping, but. Oh no, Link's horse can jump in Ocarina of Time and in Majora's Mask, so I guess. Alright. Look, Link. Do you see it? Ah, uh, the clouds? What has happened to this place? I don't know, I've never been here before. What is the meaning of this? The island, it is... We are too late. I knew we had precious, precious little time. That, I think that's kind of poorly worded. But I never suspected how little. A great water spirit named Jabun once lived here, but no sign of him remains. Oh, there, Link. What's up, bird man? So, you're here. I've been looking for you. Are you by chance seeking the great spirit, Jabun? I'm sorry to report to you that Jabun can no, can no longer be found here. Just look at how this place has been torn to pieces. I suppose this too is the work of the shadow in the Forsaken Fortress. But fear not, Jabun was able to flee this island before it was attacked. He is in a safer abode now. Would you like to guess where that abode may be? On the island where you were born. On Outset. Yet, even if you were to go to Outset now, you would not be able to see Jabun. The cave where he, hid, where he hides is sealed with a mighty stone slab that repels all who try to pass it. Why not even the pirates with their mighty ship could get it? I must apologize, Link. I thought if anyone would know of your whereabouts, it would be the pirates. I told them this tale without so much as a thought for the consequences. I don't know what they hoped to get, but they immediately set sail for Outset Island and tried to break into the cave. It is lucky they could not gain entrance. I have heard that they were last spotted on Windfall Island, but doing what, I do not know. 
If you wish to see Jabun, I think you'd better search for the pirates on Windfall Island. What an eerie isle this is. Everywhere else boasts clear skies and calm seas, but this place suffers under dark clouds and rain. Valu must have been right when he asked me to bring word of Jabun to you. He called this island cursed. I would counsel against staying here longer than you have to. But that is your decision. I have told you of Jabun, so my task is complete. So Jabun has survived. The sea spirit has lived through the trials of many long years. He must have caught wind of Ganon's attack beforehand. If we are to believe the words of the Rito postman, then the pirates know something about the cave where Jaboon hides. Why don't we go first to Windfall and search for them there? So now we're on our way to Windfall. With some awesome music in the background. Q. There we go. And hey, no sharks are interrupting. Ah, oh, dang it. Speak of the devil. Interrupt the music. Interrupting the music.
Sets. It is just as the postman told us. The pirate ship has stopped here to avoid drawing the attention of the townsfolk. Sure, I think, I'm pretty sure that would have drawn quite a bit of attention. I doubt they would tell you anything directly. If you were to ask them, I think, I think you should try to find out what the pirates are up to without them finding out about you. The link. You have here is one letter. If you wish to be a true swordsman, find some knight's crests and return to me, Orca. Thanks for the twenty rupees, Orca. Except I'm full. So, no, I don't thank you for those 20 rupees. That was a close one. I must say, that was pretty close. And in we go. Uh, th this part gets a little weird. I don't even know if I want to go through what they're saying. I don't want to say it. I'm not reading this. You can stop and read it if you want. But it gets weird.
Today's password again. Yeah, uh, yeah, he forgot it. What was it? Barnacle. And barnacle. All right. You got that guy? It's Barnacle. Yeah, it's Barnacle. <clears throat> What's up? Fortunately, I can't free you. So, that's too bad. Why well, can't I just, like, climb up here and grab those bombs? It's not stealing. Ships only two is a Into Zelda's room. Huh. I think that's uh, supposed to be Impa. Ooh. Jewelry. Link, why can't you climb up and grab it? Ah, oh, Link, my old swabby Link. So you're alive. All the other pirates said you you got done by in by that bird monster in Forsaken Fortress. So I thought, never mind. What I thought, you're alive. Oh, I get it. Now you came back because you missed me so much. I had no idea you wanted to be my swabby so badly. I see. I see. Well, after you left, I went back to being the bottom rung on the ladder. Which is why I'm stuck here while everyone else is in town having a fun, having fun and eating and stuff. But I guess being so worshipped by my swabby ought to cheer me up. Alright, why don't we set you to where your next test, to your next test, huh? This is, this one is harder than the last. Good luck, you'll need it, swabby. You can see there are lanterns hanging throughout the room, right? Well, last time when you pressed the switch, platforms rose up from, for you to jump onto, right? Yeah, well, this time there aren't any. Which means you have to jump from one rope to the next rope. Pretty tough. <laughs> and that's not all. This time, I've put a gate on this door, too. The switch opens the gate, but it'll close if you don't get here before time runs out. 
Run out of time and you'll have to try it again, little swabby. The switch that opens the gate is the same place is in the same place as before. So go step on it. If you get all the way to the this side before the time runs out, I'll give you the bombs we got in town, yeah? You heard me. Give it your best shot, Swabby. Oh, he shut the door on himself. Well, bye Nico. <laughs> Have a good one. I don't even know why I just jumped off right there. Link, step on the damn switch. Now, step on this switch. Gotta be. You did it already? You're you're incredible. This isn't good. I never even passed this test. How the heck did you get over here then? You have a ladder? Is that how you get over here? How could he do it so quickly and make it look so easy? If I give him this to him, everyone will know for sure. I'll be so busted. Okay, you're the best Swabby of all time, so I guess I'll just give you the bombs. Go on, take them. Just don't tell anyone, okay? I'm serious. Really serious, okay? Okay? You got bombs! You can carry up to 30. Pull one out, then press A to throw it, or R to set it at your feet. Try it out, it's a blast. Using bombs while on your boat gives you a mighty cannon you can use to fight off seagoing enemies. Set them to those buttons and use them. That's it's, that's mighty courageous of you, trying to steal treasure from pirates. I suppose I should should be shocked, but I'm more amazed that you managed to survive after being tossed out of that tower. From the look on your face, I have to guess you haven't saved your sister yet, huh? You don't get you don't give things much thought, do you? You just rush in, never thinking how badly things could get for you. Like just now, the only reason you got what you did was because we left a simple-minded little rat like Nico behind to look after things. No one else would have parted with our treasure so easily, I assure you. And I just... And I... And just know... And just how do you intend to use those bombs anyway? Don't tell me you're going after Jabun's treasure too. Right now, Jabun is hiding in a cave at the at the back of the island you were born on. 
but the entrance is blocked by a giant stone doorway. You can't get in without breaking down the door. We're going to relax in town and eat our fill of whatever this town has to offer, but we'll be leaving for outset first thing in the morning. If you manage to find Jabun tonight, then I guess you win. But if you take too long, we'll come sailing right by you tomorrow morning. And believe me, you didn't get all of our bombs. You'd better be quick, kid. Yeah, you... Wow, awesome. You have a stone just like the one that Miss Tetra has. Hey, how do you use that thing? Can you... Can you talk to Miss Tetra through that? Man, you're so lucky. Well, not like Link's getting laid. Anyway, time to get out of here. And uh, I'll probably stop this video here. And then we'll continue with our trip to Outset Island afterwards. Alrighty, so I guess this ends the ep uh, no, I didn't want to, yeah, this doesn't do anything. Anyway, I guess this ends this episode. I'll see you guys all in the next video. Bye.